Hello students, in this video we are going to learn how to find the HCF of 96 and 404. For finding the HCF, we will be using the prime factorization method. In this method, we divide numbers by prime numbers and find the factors of the numbers. And after finding the factors, we find the HCF by taking the common factors between the two numbers. So let's start by dividing the numbers by prime numbers. So first we'll divide 96 and then we'll divide 404 by prime numbers and find their factors. So 96 is an even number. It is easily divisible by 2. 2 times 4 is 8. 1 is remainder. This becomes 16. 2 times 8 is 16. Again we can use 2 to divide 48. 2 times 2 is 4 and 2 times 4, 8, 4 is 8. 2 times 1 is 2. 2 times 2 is 4. 2 times 6 is 12. 2 times 3 is 6. And 3 is a prime number. It is only divisible by 3. 3 times 1 is 3. So the number is fully divided. We got the factors of 96 on the left hand side of the ladder. Now let's divide 404. 404 is an even number. It is divisible by 2. 2 times 2 is 4. 2 times 0 is 0. 2 times 2 is 4. Again we can divide by 2. 2 times 1 is 2. 2 times 0 is 0. And 2 times 1 is 2. Now 101 is a prime number. It is not divisible by any number other than 101. So we will take 101 and divide it by 101. 101 times 1 is 101. So we got the fact factors of 404 and 96. Now we will find the HCF of the two numbers. So the factors of 96 are 2 times 2 times 2 times 2 times 2 times 3 times 1 and the factors of 404 are 2 times 2 times 101 times 1. Now to find the HCF of the two numbers we are going to find the common factors in between the two numbers. So let's circle the common factors. Here we see that 2 is a common factor in between the two numbers and there is another 2 which is common to both the numbers. That's all. So to find the HCF, we are going to take the product of both these prime, both these common factors. And we are going to take the product only once. So 2 times 2 is the HCF of the two numbers. So HCF is 2 times 2 which is 4. So the HCF of two numbers 96 and 404 is 4. So this is how we can find the HCF of any number easily by using prime factorization method. I hope this video is helpful to you. If you like the video, please hit the like button and subscribe to my channel for more math videos. Thanks for watching.